Donaldina Cameron was a woman whose deep faith dictated her actions and enabled her to engage in the dangerous work she embraced for over four decades. When confronted with the injustices of society, she fought for its most vulnerable members who had no one else to help them. At the turn of the 20th century, thousands of Chinese women were deceived, brought to San Francisco, and forced into slavery or prostitution. They were trapped in miserable lives, controlled by merciless brothel owners, and were forced to live without dignity or basic human rights. These girls and women could not speak English. There was no one they could turn to for help. They had no place to go. In 1895, at the age of 25, Donaldina was recruited by the Occidental Board President, Mrs. Mary P. D. Brown, to volunteer at the Mission Home in San Francisco, teaching English and sewing for one year. Little did she realize that this simple act of service would evolve into a lifetime of ministry. Donaldina risked everything to rescue and slave women and girls, and she gave them opportunities to live meaningful lives. She continually put her life at risk and sacrificed personal comforts and dreams, including marriage, to help these girls upon whom society had turned its back. She fought against unscrupulous politicians and police, and against a system that regarded Chinese as undesirables and denied them citizenship. Donaldina was a woman of strong faith who felt that God had called her to work at the mission home. Her favorite Bible verse, Yet will I rejoice, reflects her deep and abiding certainty that God was ever present and would see her through whatever difficulties she encountered. Donaldina Cameron served at the Mission Home for 40 years until she retired in 1935. She is credited with rescuing over 2,000 people from slavery and breaking the back of the Chinese slave trade in the United States. Over the decades, Cameron House has continued the legacy that Donaldina established. Responding to the changing needs of the Chinatown community, it assists not only immigrant Asian women, but their families as well. To countless people who walk through the doors, Donaldina's spirit of generosity and love is still present. In Cameron House, they find hope, help, and a new life.